one of them is ready to snap. I think something is seriously wrong with him. Just leave me alone and I'll leave you alone, OK? You're a pain in the ass. I can give a shit. Well, shut it and leave me alone, OK? Absolutely insane. <laughs> <laughs> Two are heading for a fall. <laughs> I'm ready to kick some air. Oh, my God. I can't handle it anymore. Wheels all right. Perfect. Three are hanging on for immunity. Hey, old Mark. Anna. What are we going to do? Oh, shit. But oh. is it game over for one? Mark, Go. come in. That man is in serious, serious pain. One of the camp has had a fall. And two of them have had a fallen out. Life's not getting any easier. Here and I'm a celebrity. Get, Get me out! Good morning. Welcome to Australia, where the big news is that Rodney Marsh spent last night out of the camp. We'll have the full story for you later on in tonight's show. And we've also got the third and final bush battle for you, where one more celebrity wins immunity from the first vote off tomorrow night. But before all that, to yesterday, which started very early, at 4.21am, to be precise, with a race for the toilet, a race to clean the pans, and a race to light the fire. But this was no ordinary race. This was a John Burton race. John's like a whirlwind in the mornings. John marched in in his pants, picking up branches, snapping twigs and relighting a fire. You know, people weren't impressed. There's like nine people asleep. And John, this mad dog Englishman, comes into camp and he's clanking pots and he's throwing down wood and he's stomping around my bed. I think. I think something is seriously wrong with him. There's something off. A, he wants attention, and B, he doesn't display any courtesy whatsoever for anyone's sleeping habits. Absolutely insane. Not funny, like, is it? I'm um, bad in the morning. If you'd done that, then what? You'd get a wallet. Then right up his head. Shut up. Four o'clock. Here's a log for you. Whoosh. Keep Four it down over there, Burton Race Face. Come on. <laughs> race Face. Now, we, we all know that sweets are bad for you. Right, kids? They rot your teeth, ruin your gums, and you bite your tongue. What? You bite, they bite your tongue. The sweets bite your tongue. Shut <laughs> up. <laughs> Latest Bush took a trial will reveal all. Feast your eyes on this. 
It's a confectioner's with a difference. Full of mouth-watering treats. These delights must be tasted, but not eaten. This is Jungle Sweet Shop. The lines are now open for Jungle Sweet Shop. The two celebrities with the most votes will face this one together. And with the vote offs starting tomorrow, this is your last chance to control who does a Bush Tucker trial. Rodney has been ruled out of this one oh, on medical grounds. Another one? Yes. He's out today, is he? Yes. Right, uh, right. In that case, I'm not doing it either. I'm out of this next link on medical grounds. <laughs> <laughs> You know, what? Nah. for Anna, dial 09021 32 3201. Well, nope. Keris is 02. 03 for Gemma. J is 04. Janice is 05. Do you want to pick up on the second page? Nope. John is 06. Lynn is 07. 09 for Mark. Kate is 11. And 12 for Biggins. Do you want to do the boring stuff? No. Nope. Calls cost 50p from a BT landline. Calls from mobile and other networks may be higher. 15 pence from each call goes to charity. Details which can be found on itv.com forward slash celebrity. Do you want to do the lines close? Nope. Lines close late tonight. Vodcast after that time will not be counted, but may still be charged. Can do this bit? Medical grounds. <laughs> Can't be done. Now to the latest trial where your votes meant Jay took on his first one while Janice recorded a world record seventh. How hungry are you? Remember, you've got Warrior. Warrior man with you, Jay. And it's obviously not going to be anything animally or... Yeah, but you don't know. I had Warrior Man Rodney with me. You don't know. You don't know. That's why I'm flipping. I am made up because I've been waiting to do one since we got here. I've had a good night's sleep. I've put more food in my belly than I've put in um, probably for the past four or five mornings. Uh, my energy levels are high and I'm ready to rock and roll. I'm ready to kick some ass. Janice can be de really determined when she wants to be. Um, I think my kind of energy level is going to fire her up. She's going in there with someone who isn't bothered about what they're doing and who isn't afraid of what's sort of over the horizon. I'm sweating bullets. I'm sweating bullets. Just, yeah, I have, but I'm just sweating like my adrenaline. Fancy a walk up the bridge? Oh, mm, yes, I'd love to. Love yeah, love to. Fancy a walk up the bridge? I'll come with you, mate. Yeah? Yeah, OK. Good luck, Jay. Good luck. Jay's going to control. Who hasn't been up yet? Maybe you should go yeah. She's going. She's going. Who else? All right. Well, uh, I'm going with you. Gemma. Huh? Well, you always go, John. Why yeah, don't you let someone else go? Three. Three. You come. Mwah. Gemma comes. Oh, well. and Anna. Thank you. Isn't, it, isn't this diplomatic? Bye-bye. Oh, darling. All right. Yeah. Charming, charming. Unbelievable. Oh, so f***ing pushy every time. I'll go, mate. You guys See rock. Good yeah, team. See you when you get back. Oh. Come on, guys. Lovely day. Dennis, any time you want me to, I'll take your place. Now. OK, done. I'm in. He, uh, John, I'm sorry. He doesn't give anybody ever a chance. I'll go. just say sorry, cos they, they have to... Oh. She's got their three. Yeah, but... He, he he's pushed, gone. He, I know. Every time. Have a word with him. You're the one that's got his ear. He's so f you know. Yeah. It just doesn't give people a chance. See you soon. Bring us up. Yeah, we're going to bring a feast back, hopefully. Good luck, Jay. Cheers, mate. Love, mate. Thanks, guys. Ta -ta. Love you. I bet he comes back with 11, don't you? I think for Janice's sake, if I was going to do a trial with anybody, and I was, do you know what I mean? He's the guy to do it with, isn't it? Yeah. Easy peasy. Look, if there's a rat out there, or if there's a snake, or any spiders, I'm out. You know, I'll pull the plug. There's anything to eat or like, you know, suck on or like stick up my ass. No way. I can't handle it anymore. We're gonna do this, Jay. We are. We're gonna go back with a trailer load of food. You know what? And a feast. You know, I'm so starving. I wish we, we have to do this. Yeah. Oh my God. Morning. What is going on? <laughs> oh my God. How are you? I'm ready for the pate. Yeah. First time, Jay. Yeah, mate. Welcome. Yeah. I thank you. So it's Uneasy Rider. Do you want to know what it's all about? Indeed, mate, yeah. Okay. Before I tell you the rules, are you any good at riding a motorbike? Yeah. Yes? Yeah. Jay, Janice? I, I, I'm not good at driving. Do you think you'd be good riding a motorbike 100 foot from the floor over a ravine? I'll get that thing going over there, yeah. Yeah? yeah. You, you'll give it a go? Yeah, absolutely. Well, this is Uneasy Rider. As you can see, we've got a motorbike and a sidecar. OK. You have to both get on here, decide amongst yourselves,